Hey everybody, this is Ori from AstroWeb and wanted to give you this quick tip on how to save time when you transfer a lot of files and folders in your FTP client. Um, so of course it depends, uh, the speed of transferring files depends on your connection, but uh, as a rule of thumb, the more files you have, uh, the longer it takes. And for example, we just wanted to transfer our WordPress a blog folder with all of the system, the WordPress system and the file uploads and, and all that stuff and a lot of folders and it takes a ton of time. So right now if we're on our server and I'm just going to try to uh, transfer this entire folder, it'll tell me on this connection and it'll take, tell me that it, it's, it'll take a, I don't remember, some kind of crazy amount of time, half an hour or more or something like that. So in, in order to save time in this really quick uh, world, you know, we, we're less and less patient all the time. Uh, what we can do is the following. So I'm going to stop this first of all. Um, so really, really simple thing. What we can do is we can basically go to the, the server and zip the folder and all the folders that we want, make it one file and then just transfer it over and then transfer to the new server or to the new location and unzip. So very, very simple. So uh, I just created a very simple PHP file you can see right here and it just has the following command. So uh, basically use the system, system uh, zip minus r, r is recursive. So go in every single folder inside the folder, uh, call the uh, specific uh, zip file that we want to create, blog.zip because we're right now compressing the blog folder. and on the current directory where we're going to place it, let's compress whatever's inside the blog folder. Very simple. And at the end, when you finish, um, just just uh, type in the word finish so we know we didn't time out or something like that. So very simple. So uh, I'm just going to throw it right here uh, to the folder and I'm going to go to the URL. Okay. And let's click. And you see it's starting to run. So because there's a lot of files, uh, it's going to take a little while, probably, I don't know, 20 seconds or, or a little more. But uh, once, you, once it completes here, it's starting to, to output all of the files. You can see there's tons of folders and files here, just tons and tons. And that would really take a long time to transfer them one by one. So you really want to save time and do things smarter, more than just saving time. Just, just you know, you have a computer, you have programming, so just... Uh, just upload. It's very, very simple. And I'll also include the code on the YouTube description so you can see and just copy and paste that easily so you don't have to kind of research it. So I'm going to scroll all the way to the bottom and I can see the finish. So we know it created it. So now if I go, uh, let's refresh this and I'm going to look for um, blog.zip. You can see right here. So all you do is just copy it. Uh, to your your computer and I've already copied it to save a little time. It's about 30 megabytes if you can see. And now I'm going to go, I'm going to close this server. I'm going to go to, to the server we want to transfer to right here and I'm just going to copy it. So you just throw it here and of course I've saved time so you don't need to transfer. It's 30 megabytes. Now what we want to do is we want to create a new um, file and we'll call this file actually unzip right because we need to un unzip it and all you need to do is, is just call system unzip and call the um, the zip file and of course output when we finished okay so let's do that and copy to the server unzip now we're going to go to the server master web link unzip.php and let it run. So uh, very, very simple. You can you have everything. It's so much quicker. It's so much easier. And let's scroll to the bottom, verify that it's there, and we're good to go. OK, all the way to the bottom. And finished. Now we're going to refresh and look for this blog uh, folder. And we're good to go. So hope hope you enjoy this video. Hope this helps you. I'll include again the uh, code in the YouTube description. Let me know if you have any questions. We'll be very happy to help anybody. Thank you.